I want to do this. You got to see this one right here. The, let me set this up. This, I saw this video the other day, and I have to put this in our podcast because this bitch was getting gas. You know how the gas tanks are on one side of the other tank, other side? Yeah. She pulls in the wrong side of the pumps, mm-hmm. right? But then she leaves the thing in. And, no, where do you huh? see this? It's really self explanatory. As a gas attendant for ten, eight years. No, no. Right, but this is self serve. Know something. Pulls in. Okay. See if gonna get gas. She's, she's on the wrong side. Right. Gets out of the car. Apparently in England, she's driving to the other side. Nope, wrong way. I gotta go to the other side of the pumps now. Then I'll be able to put gas uh, in the yeah, car. Yeah, and then she's not. Yeah, there we go. Okay, How now many it's damn fixed up. Times has she done? Oh my god! I've never seen. Somebody. I can't. I can't do this now. I gotta get back. Uh, I now can, I have a gas in the car. This is how stupid people were, though. Yeah, here, here we go. go. Here we I'll go. Try this pump. I haven't tried this oh one yet. Oh my god! It's the one I in can't. front of the last one. Nope. Now what still. do I do? I, I what would? It just doesn't huh. work. I can't hey. put gas in my car ever again. Yeah. I've got, and then she's gonna try that last final. No, she's trying that one again. This has to be how the made fuck? Up. No, I no, actually, it's not made up. I actually, I actually do believe this because people are that retarded, and I know that from working with customers. Only because that car's there does she get it right now. Yeah, that's an example. She would have just did the same thing it's over and so over again. so ridiculous. People are that stupid. They really are. They really yeah. are that stupid. Man, that's a lot of people, too. That, that were stupid. At least that stupid at one point. There's videos of there. All the shit that's inside it's your body. Best these bugs. Now, I wonder how many of those are people that have died and then, uh, that came back to life as the these bugs. Oh, maybe. This is their afterlife. Their on somebody else's body. For the naked eye to see. What you imagine is thousands of these, hundreds of thousands of these things right now, walking in your Depending skin right now. Yeah. Hundreds of, hundreds of them. Walking around. Hey! If you thought about that at all times, you wouldn't be able to exist. I would. Like people with OCD and stuff, yeah. you would not be able to get past that. Our skin itself that would cripple hides you. hides a miniature world from the normal view of our eyes. It's bizarre. It's a little Microsoft. Me, but, yeah, when if you seen think about it, it's ter- that's an terrible. Landscape appears. So next time a bug lands on you, just right. be glad it's just one and not billions. Or, but their billions are always on you. They're always on you. They're walking around all the time. Yeah, so it's just another one. just don't know. On almost any strand of hair, tiny fungi can be found. In numerous forms, their population... Doesn't matter how many fucking showers you take or how many how much you scrub. It's... As soon as you're out of the shower, Doesn't it's matter. you're back. Our intimate fellow travelers, fungi have lived with intimate us fellow travelers. to establish a There's permanent so much to be learned. habitat of our skin. So much. So, this is why ign- ignorance is bliss. That's only one In the hair. Of everyone's eyelashes live tiny mites called Demodex folliculorum. Living in my fucking and eyelashes right now. No Feasting on something up there. No harm. Exactly what they do. They definitely don't crawl down and eat your vision over time. But they're there. They're chomping away on something. Are they flying off when I flutter my eye- eyelashes? Nope. Did a bunch of them just fly off or no? Less desirable you would never That's know That's nasty looking there. Meet particular human Where does he live? The headlouse, a tiny and bothersome pest, That's probably just a bad example. Family, like, they got a bad batch of hair. Like, they, they tested the so wrong person or something. Here. It can't be everybody. This person must not have took a, a bath a for weeks. By burrowing directly into the skin. No, that's impossible. I don't believe it. That's some other reality. That's this reality, sir. No. Regions of our skin. It's not happening to me. Life in not in my backyard. Place. Yeah, it is, sir. Uh, Bacteria, the simplest form of free living life, are constantly with us. They're everywhere. A single bacterium can multiply to more than a million in about eight hours, and no matter how much we wash, millions remain on our skin. No way. Really? Wow. That's impressive. Each of us is the keeper of a huge and it causes you to lose your voice when you get a cold. You can't talk very good anymore because the bacteria is eating up your lungs. Uh, we got extra bugs. Yeah, got extra bugs. We got extra crawlies. Extra bugs. Oh if man, people are just disgusting. Huh? Even the most yeah, beautiful are people are disgusting. They're disgusting. sickening, disgusting. They really are. Boil it down. And they're just pieces of dirt. Sick. Everyone's just is a sick. Walking scum. 